Ten. No shoes. <laughs> oh, happy day! Yeah. Yeah. It is truly a happy day. May I speak for all of us in thanking Brittany and Eric for bringing us together in this glow of love. In our happiness, we've become a reflection of your love. It's easy to see and feel the unity here. This is not meant to separate me from all of us, but it is an expression of unity. It's a hug around the neck. <laughs> I'm Kevin Carney, Brittany's dad, and Eric's friend. Soon to be dad-in-law. Here in Kenny and Dan's home, there are many hugs to give and to get. Thank you all for sharing in this opportunity of love. Thank you, Dan and Katie, for your loving invitation and preparations to be here. This is a common gesture for anyone who wears a shirt like this. <laughs> it can be understood as the word namaste. Namaste means the goodness in me recognizes the best in you. It's an expression of unity where we bring our two separate sides together for a moment. As we see here, two separates <coughs> coming together. May Eric and Brittany always find their oneness triumphs over their separateness. If you're not used to this gesture, <laughs> certainly each of us has reached out to another for a handshake. In some belief systems, that can be the unity that finds expression in the namaste. You may fall in love to begin with, but you choose to stay in love every day by honoring your commitment to your partner. Brittany and Eric have chosen to pronounce and display their commitment here today and forever. They have and will continue to seek ways to bring their separate identities into lasting unity. Knowing their love of nature and the outdoors, it's so great that we are able to surround them in this lovely outdoors. Wedding vows are implied here in this celebration, but Eric and Brittany have chosen to share the intimacy of their statements of love and devotion their vows during their honeymoon. I'll ask them to make a sim simple declaration of that intent now. As you face each other holding hands, I ask, do you, Eric Voorhees, take Brittany Carney to be your lawfully wedded wife? I do. <laughs> do you, Brittany Carney, Take Eric Voorhees to be your lawfully wedded husband. I do. <laughs> You'll now exchange rings, supported and presented by your family representatives, Katie and Chris. These precious bands are a symbol of the unending commitment and a constant reminder of your spouse whether you're flying or in court. <laughs> Please exchange rings. You're married. <laughs> Show us your first married kiss. I now present to you the married Eric and Brittany.
Eric, you're funny. <laughs> Eric, you're supposed to come over here and hug your parents. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Please, Scarlett. <laughs> Uh, I'm sorry. <laughs> Go this way. Oh, sorry. Yeah. Beautiful. Just beautiful. Yay! Oh my god! 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 Oh my I took a video of the whole thing. The whole thing. Okay. And I'm still taking it. <laughs> I guess I should get her. Get her what? Yes. Sure. Okay. I guess she wants a sword. Congratulations. That was unexpected. <laughs> No, I didn't. Oh. No. I'm sure, Alan, if we do